Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to set up your NVIDIA RTX voice plugin uh, with OBS. And um, if you're like me and you utilize a Go XLR and an XLR microphone, um, you know, it can get a little bit confusing as far as like routing um, your audio through your um, XLR mic and then getting it to output onto OBS. Uh, it's actually fairly simple to do. Um, and we're going to go ahead and show you how to do it today. All right, so once you've gone to the NVIDIA website, um, I'll post a link in the description below, and downloaded the NVIDIA RTX Voice app, this is what you're gonna find. So your input device, uh, if you're using the GoXLR or GoXLR Mini, you're pretty used to you know your input device being your chat mic. Um, on this, same thing. You just go through, choose your default device, or choose your input device, which is gonna be your uh, chat microphone. As you can see, it sees, says TC Helicon GoXLR Mini. Choose that make sure that this box right here is checked and or suppression is up to 100%. That way it will suppress, you know, any outside noise. Um, if you have the resources for it and you want to utilize it, I personally don't. I've got a single streaming PC set up, so I, you know, I'm not going to be removing background noise from incoming audio. But if you want to try it out when you're not streaming or when you're, um, you know, not creating content, absolutely feel free to. Um, you can just check this box and it should back. The idea is that it will uh, cut out background noise for um, incoming audio. So like, you know, if you're playing online with that one dude who has a fan going in the background, this will cut that out. Uh, once that is selected, what you're going to want to do is go here into the settings, um, go down to audio. Now, normally, if you have a Go XLR um, or Go XLR mini, you're just going to have one audio input output um and that's just going to be the broadcast stream mix so if we go over here to go xlr the broadcast stream mix is going to be everything on this line right so microphone chat music game console line in system and your samples in your go xlr settings right here you're going to want to go down to mic and go down to the broadcast stream mix you're going to want to turn this off otherwise see if, see if I, I enable it here, here you're going to hear, hear double, double the audio, audio. So the crazy thing about um, NVIDIA RTX is that it doesn't actually go out through your um, Go XLR. Um, it creates a buffer that catches it before it outputs to OBS. If you're wanting to cut all the background noise out of your mic monitoring, it's not going to do that just yet until Go XLR, you know, fully supports it and fully gets released. You know, anything along those lines. All right. So that just about covers um, everything to do with OBS and GoXLR, um, being able to get the two to talk to, ch to each other um, so that your stream quality can be top notch. Um, if you have any other questions, feel free to drop them in the comments below. Uh, leave a like if you did like the video. Uh, if you want to talk to me live, I can answer any questions you may have. Uh, if you follow me at twitch.tv forward slash Spethalo, I'm live every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday uh, from 5 p.m., uh, Mount Standard Time until uh, pretty much whenever I feel like getting off. Um, I'm also available Sundays um, at 7 p.m. Uh, Mount Standard Time. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'll post clips as well as any other uh, tech videos that I can find. Have a good one.